Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's See What Happens. This is Jeremy, we're playing Steam World Dig 2, and I fixed my key bindings to be just a little bit more better than they... Ugh, more better. Ugh, god, that was awful. I, I fixed my key bindings to be better than they were last time. There won't be as much needless jumping. Apparently, for some reason, my jump button... I, I don't know. My pickaxe button was also causing me to jump. Couldn't tell you why. But now, I do not have that problem. Ah, dang it. I want... There. Do I want to go in here? Patchwall Grotto. Hey, what's that? Oh, what? Can't go up there. Okay. Ooh, secret area unlocked. Heck yeah. Amulet. Upgrade clog. I want to get that. Hey, hey. Got it. All right. That was fun. Dude, you can just do that? That's not fair. I didn't think he could just do that. Over. Gotcha. And leveled up. Handy. New upgrades. So basically, with these guys, with the bad guys, you want to get to them before they can get out of their hibernation, I guess? I don't know, whatever you want to call it. But you want to hit them before they wake up. Let's call it that. Oh no, not enough space. Well, let's get back up. Might have to do a little bit more tweaking with my, uh... My key bindings. Yeah, might have to do that. Alright. We're gonna figure this all out. Yeah, found some stuff! Nice. Will do. All right. So, I, uh, I, uh, what was his voice? I, uh, <laughs> I noted that your armor had some dents in it. My new shipment of thick plating will let you upgrade it. So you'll have a better chance of, you know, surviving down there. Uh, what do you want to do? Yeah, that's going to be his voice now, because I've forgotten what voice I used for him. <laughs> so, um, oh man, I really ought to do, I ought to do that armor, but what I'm gonna do, 
plus five extra XP from enemies defeated with a pickaxe. Or, yeah, know that. Cool. All right, now I got a better pickaxe. Real happy about that. Let's see how better, how much better it works. Yup. Boom, boom, just like that. Very nice. Hey, where'd you come from? Uh, I mean, with a lot of this, you can just... Make your way down. There we go. <laughs> That's what you get. <laughs> that was fun. All right. So, looks like nothing else here. We'll make our way down. What do you say? Red Rock Passage. All right. It looks like you can only... Hello, Fen. This must be Red Rock Passage. It's caved in, all right. If you had some explosives, you could blow this rubble right away. That's actually not a bad idea. I should go back up to town and ask around. Yeah, explosives. Maybe you'll even blow some of your parts off. Sheesh, let's just clear out what pneumatic tubes, shall we? Man, he's weird. Cool. I've unlocked transport. All right, let's head back up. Hey, I never authorized the reopening of those tubes. Bolt your jaw, son. These tubes are the best way to move around the mine. Red Rock Passage has caved in from all the earthquakes. You can't prove the quakes did that. Could have been anything. Either way, I'll need explosives to clear it out. I bet you can find some explosives down by Burster's mining station. Just keep a bit more to the east when you head down again and you'll find it. Oh yeah, I've been there. Okay. Cool. So, well, here, let's go ahead and sell off this real quick, like. Not a whole heck of a lot, but, uh, something. 25 is the next. Oh, right. Also. Oh, splendid. You found one fascinating artifact already. To show you my blueprint, or my, to, uh, uh, uh. To show you my appreciation, I shall hand you a blueprint from my stack. Simply have to take it over to the workbench and use the cog mods to put it to good use. The Gaze of Odin. Well, now I'm con... Now I want to know. What is it? Displays your enemy's health once you've damaged them. Well, I've only got the one cog, so... That's really not going to work out for me at present. Ooh. Got new dudes. Okay, so, looks like, weird, for some reason I thought that that was a thing. Uh, 
right there. Burster Station. Alright. I need to get... Ah! Hey, will you look at that? That's fun. Hello. I'm still not happy about this thing eating me. It seems creepy. Pressure bomb! <laughs> you seem fun. So, what's the water do? Ah, interesting. Up we go! Oh, no, you don't. Hmm. All right, let's do this. And boom. I like the music change when you run out of light. It's all creepy. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Hey, cool. Yeah, secret. Some sort of rat. Ugh. Gross. Mmm. Gross. <laughs> Put that away. Alright. Now let's just clear out the passage. Okay, looks like the only way out is up. The only way out is through. Hey, cool, look at that. Yeah, cog. Got it. All right. I think you can only do the upgrade cogs at the workbench. Boom! Level up! All 
right. <laughs> All right. Let's blow this thing to smithereens. <laughs> you really need to talk to somebody about the whole wanton destruction thing. I'm talking to you about it right now. When am I not talking about destruction in general? Yeah. That's true. Okay. So let's get some water. Do. Oh, interesting. There's a, a distance limit. And boom. Hee <laughs> boom! Let's do that again. These bombs sure will come in handy. They'll be able to reach places my pickaxe can't. I guess I should go tell the mayor the passage is open again. Yeah. We should. We will here in just a minute, too. Barrel. Secret. Nice. All right. Well, yeah, let's get head on back up because I can't really see what I'm doing. First off, let's sell to this guy real quick. Nice. Very nice. All right. <clears throat> let's put a cog into... Stops pressure bombs from hurting you. That'd be a good one to have. Yeah, we're going to do that. I don't want pressure bombs to hurt me. I think that's going to help me out quite a bit. There we go. Upgraded the lamp. Got upgraded body armor. Sweet. Um, I like your gear. So, uh, you could improvise it by using cogs. Do uh, you want to know how? No, I already know. Okay, well, yes. Sorry. Uh, be over here. It's hard to keep their voices straight. I'm not going to lie here. Now that Red Rock Passage is open, I can look for Rusty deeper down. Hey, that bot still missing? Well, just don't forget to bring some of that valuable ore up with you now. It should be clear mining all the way down to the protective wall, dearie. I guess your pal could have slipped through one of them darn cracks in it. If I was you, I'd head down to Mason's station. There should still be an old equipment machine down there, and it'll make your life a whole lot easier. You mean the one my idiot brothers walled in last year while laying brick? Well, Tarn Nation, I bet you can find a way around the brick if you scout the place. Hey now, report any opening you find to me so I can have someone patch the wall up later on. Probably not going to do it. Whoa. That's pretty far down. Holy cats. That's going to take some time, y'all. Alright. Well. Oh, do I have another... <laughs> Gee whiz. You look like a small town bot, just like me. How wonderful. I've been feeling so lonely lately, like a proper outsider. I just thought it was the whiff from the outhouse, but yeah, it's that outsider smell, all right. The glowing, sparkly thing is right. I'm not really cut out for big city life. Could you try to be a little nice for a change, Fen? You might like it. I doubt it. Go up, please, now. Thank you. Uh, looks like I've got another cog that I can use. Increases your lamp light radius. Why, thank you. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. 
Okay. All right. Cool. Now, I've got a stronger lamp, more shielding, which I think means just, like, more health. Woohoo! Got him. All right. I could, you know what? I should be taking that pneumatic tube, huh? As I am fairly certain that I have gotten everything there is to get from here. again. I still gotta get the aiming right on all of these things. I played SteamWorld Dig 1 for a little bit of time. Uh, not, not much, but I enjoyed it. I liked it. I saw a bunch of stuff on this one. Not when it came out, kind of, kind of a lot after the fact. But it seemed to me that it made some additions to the original. That made the gameplay a little bit smoother. So, I'm all about smoother gameplay. Go back up. Next should be focusing on a bigger bag. Because we're running out of space pretty quick like. If you haven't been on some shyness, clip him before you end up in a wooden overcoat. From what I've heard, they're usually all gowed up on moon juice and looking to scrap, see? They can't get enough of that sludge. It makes them stronger, but it also makes them all goofy. It's also highly corrosive. So you probably don't want to take a dip in it. Well, yeah, that makes sense. Also, moon juice. So, there's that. <laughs> I, I don't want to, like, bathe in anything called moon juice. It sounds weird and gross. Oh, uh, let's see. New backpack. Thank you. There we go. That ought to help. Oh, dang it. I keep doing the same thing. Let's... Let's take the uh, expressway down. All right, <clears throat> here we go. All 
All right, we'll go straight across. We can see a little bit better. Ah, you big... Oh no, I've... <laughs> ha! Well, this could be bad. Shoot, I done did a dumb. Well, that was dumb of me. But... Cinnabar! Awesome. Alright. Let's go rectify the dumb that I just did. Bye. Well, we can do this. Light's running out. That's no bueno. Gotcha. All right, that's better. Okay, so it's dark. We can deal with the dark. Because we are going to go... Right into here. Cave in catacomb. That's probably not the right way to go about it. Oh, heck. Yeah, it's like that, is it? Okay. Boy, it got real there for a minute, didn't it? Spelunky Diary, like from Spelunky, the game. Which I don't have, and I have not played, but I uh, have watched some stuff on. Looks fun. There we go. We'll make sure that there's nothing down here, like, that was hidden. No, nope. Just darkness. Alright. Okay, been through there.
<laughs> Boy, that's fun. Oh no, not enough space. Don't talk to Finn. Hey, your bag's already full, doofus. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh, I didn't know that would happen. Oh, dang. All right, so, ah, crap. If you smash a thing that you've dug up, one of your ore or what have you, uh, then you smash it and it's done and you're toast. Isn't that, isn't that fun? Isn't that a whole bunch of words? Well, well, poop. I'm mad you can't, like, go down these stairs. All right. Yeah, there you go. There you go, Bonacle Jones. Anything? Probably not. Nope. Let's see. I got two cogs. Nah. Reduces your fall damage. I haven't really started taking too much fall damage. I'm going to hold off for now. Let's, let's really hoof it. Copper, very nice. Well, there it is. Okay, well, almost there. Ow. 
Okay. Got him. Woohoo! Transport tube. Present. Oh. Schrodinger's what? Hilarious. Oh, not enough space! But that's okay. Alright. Yeah, I know. We need light. All the way up. Alright, guys. That's gonna do it. We're gonna sell this off. Nice. Alright. Let's do an upgrade real quick. Um, man, I should go with more light, but what I really want is more... Yeah, what I really want is more space. I mean, really, you should max out space in this game. First chance you get. And we'll do that. Cool. All right. That's going to do it for now, guys. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you like what I'm doing. Really appreciate you guys taking time out of your busy day to drop by, see what I'm up to. Um, I'm having a lot of fun playing this cute little game. So uh, if you guys are enjoying it, please let me know. I really appreciate all the comments that I get. Um, you know, it means a lot to me. It really does. I know I say it every episode but you know it really does like seeing that i've got a new comment even if it's just a hey i noticed that you did this that's real cool or hey have you thought about doing this maybe that might help or just a discussion of like what's going on in the episode that i've posted uh really any of it it just uh it makes my day hold on a sec Wow, look at that. Well, we'll explore up there next episode, I think. <laughs> Alright guys, as always, I'll see you next time. Bye.